Good morning, everybody. Relic right here. Uh, we had a brand new permission, 400 acre farm here in middle Georgia. Supposed to have three or four house sites on it. We're at an intersection of an old road. Um, there's a house here that was gone before 1950. So uh, yeah, dig around here and see what we can find. Let me see where everybody's at. There's a guy that invited us here, uh, Michael and uh, Jake. Anyway, yeah, the landowner I think is gonna dig with us and uh, Jeff Upton's right there digging with us. And you probably already saw uh, Justin's right up there digging. Yep, and I couldn't see him. So anyway, uh, I'm on second hole of the day. Got a good strong signal here. I started at uh, 1410, so I'm on 1412. So yeah, come go with us, see what we can find. All right, everybody, third hole on the day. Legend says I flipped it out of the ground. Somewhere. Sort of an iffy, buttony, pull tab type signal, but. Ah, well, head stamp, just the, just the head of the head stamp. Anyway, go a little fine. All right, everybody, fourth hole on the day. Didn't get it out, but I do think I moved it. Wasn't the best signal. Sort of a bottle cap type deal. Moving it around. And I need to take that off, of course, as usual. My pin pointer saying, come on, I got you right here. Ah, ah, a little green coin. Little green coin, what we got here? Well, we got Lincoln on the front. Can't see a date, although it's in pretty good shape. Got us old weedy. Do a little stuff. Uh, so, redid my, redid my detector a little bit. Oh, I need that pointing up more. Anyway. Got y'all where y'all can be in two different spots. So yeah, go low weedy. All right, everybody. Fifth hole on the day. I thought I saw it. I did see it. How about them apples? There you go. Ha! Huh. Cleaning up my truck today. I had a fork almost exactly like that in my truck. Go low fine, old brass uh, forkety fork. All right, everybody. Jeff wandered out through there. Got Mike digging right there. Jake back behind Justin, and Justin said, oh, I think I found something. Ha, 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 It's like the one I dug up there by the horse barn. How cool is that? It's still got the pin on the back. Yep, Look at that. Very, very oh, cool, man. Nice. Awesome find. Awesome oh, find, y'all. Nice. Very, very cool. Wow, it does still have the pin on the back. Mm -hmm. Now look at it. Absolutely. Very, very nice. Collar pin, U.S. collar pin. When was that? Mate? When was that worn? Probably I think early 1900s. Yeah, I think so. Pre World War One, maybe just a little, or Around that, maybe even World War One. Go a little fine. Landowner's walking over to look at it. There you oh, go. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Yeah, yeah. Collar pin. Cool stuff. Here's a plate. There you go. I Water. like that. Uh huh. Got some crackle to it. Mm hmm. Yep, old old stuff. All right, everybody, I'm gonna hold nine on the day. Everybody digging around here. Uh, I still hadn't got whatever I got out, and Justin said he had something else around. Green weedy. Green weedy, very cool. You're about, mm -hmm. look, right there behind you might be yeah. where I dug mine. Cool, and get a date. So yeah. far, they're mostly 40s, early 40s, but. It's kind of rubbed off on this one. There's going to be some older stuff here when we get this newer stuff off off the top of the I, ground. I think 40-something. 40 40-something. 40 yeah. All right. Cool. Fine. Mm -hmm. Sir? Got a ditty? Yeah. Another weedy. Nice. Yeah. Very cool. Very cool. All right, everybody. Got Mike digging right there. Jake digging up there. Justin's coming back down the road. He, he went and checked out the road. And Justin said he found another weedy or another green penny with an imprint. Oh yeah, he slid over. It did. Just right a little bit. Oh, let me get out of the way. Here we go. Very cool. Been sitting there a minute. And it is a wheat penny. Wheat penny. Very, very yeah. cool. I guess they're all gonna be 40s. Ooh, this one's a little toastier than some of them. I bet you can get a date off of that though. Anyway, cool stuff, man. Keep digging. Shoot, maybe I hadn't got it out yet. There it is. Piece of something. What is that? Is that what I think it is? 
Nope, that's not what I think it is. I thought that was gonna be a, thought there was gonna be an anchor on there. Probably a compact lid. I thought that was gonna be an anchor uh, thingy my bob, which I'll tell the story about that here in a second, not on camera, cause y'all heard it. Be right back. All right, everybody, that was hole 16 I got out that I thought was gonna have an anchor on it. But anyway, I don't know whether to get in the shade to show y'all. I'm having to look over the phone cause all the sweat in my eyes. It says Florida, Florida glove. Anyway, we'll clean that up at the tailgate and show y'all. Finding stuff right here with the cows and the, everybody. Where'd Jeff go? Jeff went and got in the shade. You didn't? <laughs> Old crusty dime that is not silver. <laughs> It'll be a 1967. I got That's money. Funny. That Probably. Was, that was right up in the dime range, but it was a long it was, it was a little weird. Like it might have been at an angle a little bit or something. Mm -hmm. but, that's exactly how that penny was I got up I there. It was on the conductive region, but it was like smeared out. Just a little bit, huh? I bet it's, I bet it's at least early 70s. Oh, it's got to be, yeah. Yeah. Cool stuff. Awesome. Well, we all thought it might have been a dime, yeah. and then we thought it wasn't a dime, and then it was a dime. Cool okay. stuff. All right, everybody. So Jake just keep digging and digging and digging. <laughs> Check this out. Got some weird looking, right weird looking coppery stuff. I'm going to show y'all what he found here in just a second. We... We kept thinking mason jar lid. No, not mason jar lid because it's got a straight edge on it. And look what he just dug out of the hole, y'all. Little leg. So it was a little uh, tin or, or copper uh, jewelry box or maybe a music box, you know, or some sort of toy. Anyway, there's one of the legs right there. Cool find, man. Keep on digging, I guess, huh? <laughs> oh, you got more of it? That's right where the leg there you go. That's where the leg was hooked. How about that? Man's never been metal detecting. Look what he's digging up. So still don't know what it is, but I don't know what it is, but it's something. Yeah, something with a leg attached right there. No way. Another might be a hinge or something. So I think that's actually maybe what came off this piece. Anyway, a kid's toy or music box or something. I'm going to lay it all right there, okay? When you get it put together, holler. I'll yeah. come back over here and film it. <laughs> I'm going to play music. There you go. All right, everybody. I flipped out a good little tone here. Jake was showing uh, Justin his music box thingy. And I flipped something out here kind of cool. Man, have y'all too far away? Do I need to yell? Well, that's cool. Nope, that's mule harness. Single tree stuff. Ow! The briar in my leg. Well, single tree stuff. How about that for a piece of square single tree? Most of it's round. Look at there, Justin. Square. Oh, cool. Yep. Most of that's rounded. Anyway, it goes around a round single tree. This one goes around a square single tree. All right, everybody. Uh, US. Justin here. Oh, yeah. Jake's here uh, doing a tailgate dump. I don't know what we're going to do next, but uh found a few little good things. U.S. collar disc, obviously one of the better. Fork. Uh, uh, Jake found a arrowhead out of a digging hole. That's about the, what, sixth one of those I've seen yeah. in the last year and a half come out of a digging hole. So. Yep. Anyway, and uh, got Mike putting some stuff on the tailgate. He had some stuff in his pouch. Bullets, pocket bullets, knife. Ooh, a little pocket knife. Like Surprised that doesn't have I a, I don't know what that is. Have a name on it. Uh, yeah, Justin. Kind of what, it was, what, what do you got, think that is? It's got a P stamped Ooh, on one side of a it. A P on one side. Mm -hmm. Might be a comb. Might be a piece it, of a. It may be, yeah. Might be a piece of a comb. Anyway, cool old stuff. Uh, yeah, we may go right back digging where we were. Don't know. Y'all come go with us. All right, everybody. Hold 26 on the day for me. Jess right over there. Jake's right down there. Digging behind that dead tree. Back through there. Mike and Justin are right up there digging. I just dug a thing. I don't know what that is. Farming related, thermostat related. Anyway, yeah, beautiful place to dig, but very, very quiet. Thought there might be a home site right there in that uh in that opening, but I don't don't think there's going to end up being one. Sorry, I just got an ow ant off me. Yeah. That's it for me so far here in about 30 minutes. Pretty place, though. 
All right, everybody. Oh, 29. 29 on the day. Check it out right here. That was a weird little signal. Probably a bullet. Definitely a bullet. Looks well, old, but not that old. Old bullet. Old 29 on the day. All right, everybody. Still in this beautiful old opening here that we thought should have been a house place. And now we're digging coins. So maybe it was a house place. What you got, Mike? Uh, looks like it's a nickel, but I don't know how old it is, though. But it was deep. It is a... It's a... I don't know. Doesn't look old, but you no. know, nickels haven't changed much. No, it looks like a modern nickel, but I bet it's an old model nickel, so I'll be probably right after a buffalo. All right, we'll get a date, see what we can, see what we can find. Cool stuff. All right, everybody, hold, hold 30 on the day for me, and after about three scoops in this hard ground, legend said I headed out, so. Wasn't a high number, could be a bullet number. No. Nope. Well, that's cooler than what I expected. Pretty sure. What is that? I believe it's an old lipstick tube. Oh, really? Yep. So, we we're thinking there's a house here, and then we weren't thinking there's a house here, and there's old, probably a squished lipstick tube case. So, maybe. Keep on digging. Washer here. Uh, you did a good here. job on finding a washer. One of the one of the better YouTubers call that washer excitement. Yeah. Cause it's gonna ring up good. And what else did y'all find? Hey, shotgun, shotgun shield. Modern or? Uh, yeah. Have plastic on it. Oh, yeah. I got you. Put that coil on the ground, sir. Put that coal on the ground. <laughs> Down in the grass. <laughs> All right, everybody. Getting out at the fourth spot on this big old middle Georgia farm. As you can see, we know we're at an old house place this time. First place was an old house place. Second, third, maybe, maybe not. Uh, grass was a little thick at the third one, so we don't really know for sure. But here, we have an old home site. So let's dig around and see what we can find. Let's see what you got. Oh, it's the top of a... Uh, no? No, I thought for a minute it was the top of a tube. I don't know. It's definitely uh, brass. I can see why that was a good tone. Mm -hmm. Interesting find, we'll call it. All right, everybody. I'm going to hold 41 on the day. Sounds like a big piece of brass. Hmm, it's not a big piece of brass, but it is a thing. I don't know. It wants to be a. I don't know. I don't know. It's either a. It's either a piece of a pocket watch or a compact. Maybe a piece of a compact. Anyway, cool little find. Rang up high. New digging friend Mike said he may have something cool. What you think, Mike? Has a back on it. I think it's more modern button. It's like a pressed one. Hmm. Two piece. Hmm. But that one rang up right on a nickel signal. That is very cool. Shanks been over right there. Uh huh. Oh, this might be. I don't know. We'll clean that up and get back with y'all. Very nice find, sir. All right. All right, everybody. Hold 36 on the date. Don't think it was anything good. I might be looking at it. Well, then, I'll take that back. Check this out, y'all. Some sort of brooch. How about them apples? Knew it rang up good. Like a big penny. Thought actually maybe uh, maybe lantern part or something. But yeah, here's the back of it. Uh, I say brooch. I don't know. I think it probably is, though. Cool, little fine. Clean that up at the tailgate and show y'all again. I don't know if we'll get all our other stuff back out at the tailgate from uh, the other sites, but I know we found two or three cool things here, so we'll show y'all that. All right, everybody. So, yeah, don't know 
don't think I've ever dug a Royal Star lighter, but anyway. That name off of it, I think it says Royal Star. Cool old stuff. Alright everybody, so Justin was coming around by the house here digging. As you can see it's old, 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 old. He said there's a Prince Albert can stuck in the hole right there, so we're going to try to get it out. Easy. Watch the waspus. Tell them what'll come out Very of Very cool. Just reach and get it right there. Cool. We're going to see if it's full of silver coins, and I don't think it is, is it? Yeah, it's <laughs> got paper money. So, well, it could be. Could be. Doesn't, feel, doesn't even feel like there's any water in it. Nope. No. Somebody had to hid their, hid their stash right there, there in the wall, yeah. Very cool. Cool, Justin. <laughs> he he looks he, he looks for everything you want it sure cool man all right y'all i'm on 50 on the day and jake's over here digging wood stove tops that's cool y'all had a handle number eight in the middle yeah yeah had a handle that went right there you picked them up and did whatever down in the wood stove so yeah while they're digging that which is very cool I found a pocket knife. Pretty dang cool one. Might have a might have a bone handle in it. That looks old, doesn't it? Sure it does. Right there. Ring up like a penny. It does, so it kind of looks like the style of the one we found over the other place. Is that a, looks a little, yep. Definitely a definitely feels like a bone. It does. That feels old, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. And cool. Very cool. Reliving history, one old relic at a time. I'm about to fall down a hill. All right, everybody, last signal of the day. Um, don't know what it is, I can see it though. Could be trash. No idea what that is, y'all. Some sort of car part or something. Hmm, they don't know. It's something very specific. Probably got some words on it somewhere. Although I don't see them anyway. Somebody tell us what that is. Done for the day. All right, y'all. We're not going to have an official tailgate picture and or video at this uh, at this last site. But uh, everybody's emptying their pouch, or we're going to see what we have. I dug a brooch and a cool pocket knife. And no, Justin. Huh? Yeah, I found that right near his button. No way. It could be some sort of handle. Though. Hey, flip it around. See if it goes in it the other way. Probably goes through a doorway. Are you on that side? Yeah. You think about the thickness of a door. Yeah, could be. Be like a oh, cool. yeah. or pool something or something. Door. Furniture escutcheon or something. What that? That's a button. That's there. your button? I don't think there's anything on the face of it. Oh. it really is? Yeah, I don't know. I'm going to scrub it with oh, plastic cool. bristles. Yeah, yeah. Is that okay? Hmm? Yeah. All right. That's oh, nice. Get right Nothing back with y'all. So we found a cool button with maybe something on it. If there is, we'll get some pictures later. Not sure. Some sort of broochy, escutcheon type piece. Uh, cool pocket knife. Yeah, is that another one? A different yeah, one? Yeah, a different one. Oh, maybe, cool. a, maybe a bone handle. Look, black bone, black on one side and white on the other. And there's a... Uh, a mark? Well, there's a shield on it. Very cool. We found some interesting stuff. Cool old Prince Albert can. Yeah. Stove top. Very cool. All right. Enjoyed it, y'all. Reliving history. One old relic at a time. Fun stuff.